everyone! Welcome back to Dalai Lama Toys! I'm Maddie, and this is my brother Michael. And today, we're having a Halloween party! We are super excited to play some Halloween games with our friends today. And look at all the prizes we have! As you can see, me and Michael are dressed up in our costumes. I'm dressed up as Mrs. Claus, and he's dressed up as Santa Claus. People should be arriving at our party any minute, so let's wait for the first person to get here. Hello! Hey Austin! Happy Halloween! Thanks Maddie! I like your guys' costumes! Mrs. Claus and Santa Claus. I'm dressed up as a basketball player. I like your costume too Austin! It's very cool! Hi! Hey Riley, we're so glad you could make it to our party today. And I like your costume. You must be a witch. Hey Maddie, hey Michael. Hi Coco, cool costume. You must be a skeleton. I sure am. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween Gabby. I love your cat costume. We're here for the Halloween party. April, Allie, Katie, I haven't seen you guys in so long. I love your costumes. I am so excited for this party. Boo boo blah blah. <laughs> Hi baby Emily, your owl costume is very cute. All right, well now that everyone is here, I think we should get started with our first Halloween game. Our first game is going to be a drawing competition, but you have to draw a Halloween picture and you only have 30 seconds to draw. You're going to have to draw your Halloween pictures super quick and then at the end of the 30 seconds, our mommy is going to vote on who wins the drawing competition. There is going to be a first place, a second place, and a third place. So three people are going to win prizes. Now I've just got to go around and pass out these sheets of paper and some markers. Okay kids, now that everyone has gotten a sheet of paper and some markers, it's time for a drawing competition to begin. And as Maddie and Michael said earlier, when everyone is done drawing their Halloween pictures, I'm going to vote for my top three favorite drawings. Okay kids, your 30 seconds to draw starts in three, two, one, go! Okay kids, the timer just went off. 30 seconds is up and now your drawings are done. I'm just going to go through and take a look at everyone's Halloween drawings and then I will decide which three are my favorites. Okay kids, I have decided who got third place, second place, and first place. And now I'm going to announce the winners starting with third place. In third place is... Gabby with her Frankenstein drawing. Yes, I got third place. All right, Gabby, you can go ahead and choose a prize from the prize table. I chose a pack of tattoos. Now it's time for me to reveal who got second place. For second place, I chose Allie with her eyeball drawing. Yes, I'd hoped that my drawing would win. I thought it was kind of creepy and perfect for Halloween. For my prize, I'm going to take the yo-yo with the eyeball on it. Now it's time to reveal who got first place. For first place, I chose... April. 
April with her cat drawing. First place? Wow, thank you so much. You're welcome, April. I thought your drawing of a cat was really cute. And since you got first place, I'll let you choose two prizes. Wow, okay. I think I'll take one of these lizards and the little parachute man. That drawing game was a lot of fun, but now it's time for our next Halloween game. Our next game is going to be Bobbing for Apples. Our mommy is going to help us explain how to play Bobbing for Apples in case you don't know. All right, everyone. So for Bobbing for Apples, we have got this bowl full of water and there are some apples floating in it. When it is your turn, what you have to do is grab an apple using your mouth. The apples are kind of hard to grab because they're floating in water and you can't use your hands. You can only grab an apple with your mouth. That's right, Maddie. So you are all going to take turns to do bobbing for apples and I'm going to time you to see who picks up the apple the fastest only using their mouth and then whoever gets the fastest time wins. All right, so we are going to start off with Michael. So when you're ready, I will just start the timer and then you can start trying to grab an apple. Okay, Michael, on your mark, get set, go. Why are these apples so hard to grab? This is so tricky. Okay, let me stop the timer. Michael did a good job bobbing for apples and he got his apple in 26 seconds. It's my turn now. Here I go. Okay, Maddie got her apple in 19 seconds. Boo boo baba. Emily got her apple in 20 seconds. Here I go. Gabby grabbed her apple in 28 seconds. Wow, Katie got her apple in 13 seconds. Coco got an apple in 24 seconds. Austin got an apple in 17 seconds. Allie got an apple in 25 seconds. It took Riley 21 seconds. Last but not least, it took April 22 seconds. Now that bobbing for apples is over, it's time to announce our first place, second place, and third place winners. We will start with our third place winner. In third place, we have Maddie with 19 seconds. Yes, I got third place. Now I can get a prize. I'm going to take this washcloth with witches' hats on it. Now it's time to announce our second place winner. So in second place, we have Austin with 17 seconds. Yes, I got second place. And I'm totally going to take one of these lizards. Now it's time to reveal who got first place in apple bobbing. Our first place winner is... Katie with 13 seconds. Yes, I did it. I got first place. Nice job, Katie. And since you got first place, you can choose two prizes. I think I'm going to take this little Dracula guy and the eyeball washcloth. All right, you guys. So that was our last Halloween party game, but we have one more thing to do before the party is over. We are going to do a costume contest. That's right. So everyone is going to vote for one other person who had their favorite costume. This is gonna be a hard decision. I don't know who I'm gonna vote for because everyone has such cool costumes. I'll give you all a minute to think about who you're going to vote for and then we will all vote for our favorite costume. Whoever has the most votes wins. Oh, and also, just so you know, you cannot vote for yourself. So you have to vote for somebody else. 
All right, you guys, so I'm going to pass out some markers again so everyone can write down who had their favorite costume. And here I have 10 slips of paper. So everyone is going to get a piece of paper and on the paper, you can just write down who had your favorite costume and then fold the paper in half and give it to me. All right, you guys, so everyone has voted for their favorite costume. And now it's time to read the votes to see who has the best costume. Our first vote goes to Gabby with her cat costume. Our second vote goes to Coco with her skeleton costume. The third vote is also for Coco. The fourth vote is for Riley with her witch costume. The fifth vote is also for Riley. The sixth vote is for Maddie with her Mrs. Claus costume. Our seventh vote is for Coco. Our eighth vote is for Riley. Our ninth vote is for Emily with her owl costume. We only have one vote left, but right now, Maddie, Gabby, and Emily all have one vote and Coco and Riley each have three votes. So let's see who the last vote is for so we can find out who has the best costume. The last vote is for Coco with her skeleton costume. So it looks like Coco wins the costume competition. All right, Coco, since you won the costume contest, you can choose two prizes. And since Riley got second place, Riley can choose one prize. For my prizes, I think I'll take this cat yo-yo and a box of tattoos. I want washcloth. All right, you guys. Well, that was our last Halloween activity. So it looks like this is the end of our Halloween party, but it was a lot of fun. Anyways, you guys, that is the end of this video, but we hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please click like and subscribe to help our channel, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye!